Good morning everybody. Slightly different video for you today. We're going to be doing a little behind the scenes. Now this is something that I get asked quite a lot. Could you film us filming behind the scenes? Could you show us what you do on a daily basis? Well today we are heading down to Bigbury Golf Club. So I thought I would show you what we get up to. Morning Jordan, you look very strapped Morning, up. Morning I'm ready, ready to go. go. I'm yeah. ready to go. <laughs> I was waiting for my uh, chauffeur to close my door for me. Uh, <laughs> have you brought your little booster seat in the corner there? <laughs> yeah, cool. I wasn't sure which one I wanted today, so I'm going to choose that a bit later. Right, enough on. chat boys, let's, yeah, let's go. go. Slight snag, there is a t we're on the tidal road and um, we're just going to see how this car gets on because I've got a van here as well, he's looking to go through. I'm not convinced this is the way to go today, but this car's going for it. Bernie, that car's going for it. You've done it. Hey. That thumbs up, Bernie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at this. It's what? This is like a little day out on its own. I love it. <laughs> Let's not bother with the goal. Maybe. Thumb up, buddy. Thumb up. Yay! <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm still not sure. He's, he's going for it. He's going for it. He's done it easy. Oh, he's, look how committed he is, that. He's doing quite quick. No. That, the problem is with the van... ...is I've got a really low front on it, so... I'm not sure... Oh, come on. It'd be funny. ...if this low kind of trim here is going to get us through it. We've got to go for it. Like, we owe it to the people. I mean, how funny would it be if we got stuck? He's lost his bottle. Pathetic. Well, we made it. We, we decided not to go down the tidal road in the end. Um, which you were slightly <laughs> upset about. But the problem is, like I said, the car, the van, has got a lowered front. Right. So as soon as you hit the water, it will just literally climb up the van. So, um, and that other van did pull out didn't he 2022 he didn't... the year of excuses yeah well why not <laughs> well we've arrived at Big Re as you can see it is pretty spectacular and we've got a beautiful day for it normally when you come up to Big Re you've got a bit of a breeze we've got a slight breeze here today probably half a club to a club wind so um, but we're going to just show you around the place a little bit gentlemen a huge welcome to Big Re I say huge morning, because everybody. it's 2022 and we are uh, we're moving places yeah. Well out, George. That's, That's right, lovely. Look, 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 Mud ball. We're cleaning mud balls, are we? We're, we're, we're at Torquay, are we? Yeah, that is. Yeah. Huh? We are at Torquay. Why, do you Talk not do winter rules in your life then? Yeah, don't want mud on the ball, do we? Don't want mud on the ball, do we? Don't show that, obviously. Yeah. What? Winter golf in the UK, it's real golf. Right, here we go. Kicks right, a little bit, yeah, just turn a little chat. Oh, sorry, off camera. I need to stay out of the Turn the camera off, off. we don't want everyone hearing our conversation. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kicks in a little bit from the left, mate. Kicks left to right. Yeah, yeah slightly it does, yeah. It did last time I played it. Nice, nice little divot coming oh, out. Lovely, Jordan. Ah, oh, super grass class. Oh. No. Nope. No. Always left. Pick that up. Pick that away. Poor. Yep, that a bit. Yeah, good yeah, part. Nice Solid half, boys. Yeah, that was uh, it's hard a tough. That. It's a tough opener. Yeah. Off. So we made our way out onto the golf course and I just had a little catch up before we teed off. I had a catch up with the general manager up here and Jason, his name is. And Jason was kind of explaining to me a little bit about Big Bree and kind of where it's kind of come from and where it's gone over the last sort of few years. Now, I played here back when I was a junior. We were not massively miles away from Churston. So it's probably about an hour's drive from where we are at Churston there. And um, Big Bree was always a course that was if I'm brutally honest, was never in the best of condition and the golf course itself, you walked in and it felt a little bit, I would say, stuffy in some ways. However, 
it has changed. It has changed massively and only for the better. The vibe, the feel that you get as you walk into the clubhouse there, it's a fresh feel. There's a little bit of music playing, the food, we've just had some lovely food before we've teed off. And it just has that relaxed kind of, I don't know really, I don't know really what to say, but it's a definitely a change in from the norm of UK golf clubs, should we say. And this golf club is benefiting massively off the back of that. They've, membership wise, they used to be around the 800 mark, they're now down to about 500, but actually 500 is a good number for them to be able to deal with all the visitors that they get here because this area here is a huge destination for lots of people to want to come and visit during the summer months certainly and you've got to think about the actual uh, town itself i think it's something like 63 percent of the homes in the town are either second homes or holiday homes so you can see the footfall of this place is very much up there and is very welcome for anyone to come and play Close to 40 inches. I'm in the zone. Out of the way. Oh, sorry. Leave sorry. Me alone. Don't listen to George. Terrible etiquette, isn't it? Really. This is, this is what I call character building exercises. It's good for the morale of the channel. It's just to tap it in, though. Team. Team, oh, no, team building, you know. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm upset. Good half, I'm that. I apologise on behalf Special, of CHD Media. Thank you, Bernie. It means a lot. So, wandering our way around this what a beautiful golf course and you can see the estuary behind us as we're as we're filming this but i need to in introduce you to somebody because this is johnny Hello. johnny johnny is coming out to have a little wander around with us because you won't know yet and we're not going to sort of reveal anything at this stage but we've got a bit of a project coming on dhd media is is going to new heights new heights for 2022 and we will release information on what's happening so with that in mind we need more help and now johnny is an editor he has just finished at falmouth yeah university with his film well hang on a minute let's get johnny to tell you a little <laughs> bit about it so i was an editor and uh, a bit of a director but we'll, we'll, we'll stick with editing yeah at falmouth university you finished I got, with the first i finished with a high first yeah i was very happy with that got 80 so the people that have gone to uni okay. might know what that means um but yeah so uh Got a, I don't know, I just came along to this and I think it's brilliant, so I'm ready to go. Exciting stuff. It is exciting. exciting stuff and it is exciting stuff for us. And, and like I said, we will tell you a little bit more about what kind of is happening with the channel and, and not the channel, but the business, the outside bit, the media bit, which has always been my kind of plan. But uh, I will tell you a little bit more about that. But it's just nice to get Johnny out here, get him to meet the guys, get him to see golf because he's not a golfer. Um, he's new to golf and we're going to be sort of obviously training him. He's going to have to learn a lot as he goes along with um, how the game of golf works and how we film it. And obviously our idea is to ramp things up a little bit and obviously bring in someone like Johnny on uh, who has that expertise in filmmaking rather than golf to film. Um, hopefully it's going to be a big thing. Trusty. Oh, and so that good. is wide. Go! Did it bloom yeah. No, I've hit a toey one. Go! Oh, front edge. Might be front edge. That was tracking. Oh, it was just right at the tip toe of the club, and I thought, hmm, not. I lose a bit of ball speed like that. Perfect, Dan. Right. Zoomed in on the hole for me. Here we go. Bit right, John. It's gone right. I can't see it from here. No, yeah, no, that's not good. So we've actually got out to the 12th hole and we've kind of finished off what we wanted to get filmed for today. And sometimes when you come to courses like this, you've got to sort of take into consideration that you're not always going to get all the holes played on the day because of sunlight. Uh, in the UK, certainly, we do run out of light. So we try our best to share with you some of our best holes on the course. So we've kind of finished up now. Um, down on the 12th hole and we're going to make our way out to I believe the 15th I think it's the 15th or the 14th yeah for 15th which is a beautiful par 3 with some absolutely spectacular views and we always think it's really important to showcase 
the courses that we play and some of their sort of key holes on the course. There is a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart moves slow Somewhere in the great unknown When I return from the afterglow I just want to say well done, very, very good. Enjoyed that. Well, we've just made our way into the bar and enjoying our drinks as we finish off this evening. Just wanted to give you a little bit of an insight into what we do. I wanted to give you a little bit of an insight into what Big Bree Golf Club has to offer. I think from what the guys were saying on the vlog, and I hope you'll enjoy the vlog, is that this golf club has come on leaps and bounds. It's a golf club that I wasn't really overly keen on wanting to come and play it as a junior but looking at what they've done looking at what the golf club have done to the golf course itself looking at what they've done to the surroundings the welcome they have absolutely raised the bar and in such a good way as well but i'd like to hear what you think about this vlog did you enjoy behind the scenes do you want to see any more of these types of videos if you are new to the channel and you like what you're seeing from our videos make sure you give this video a thumbs up put a little comment down below and we'll see you all again very soon cheers i had a feeling but the feeling is all gone wait hold on put me together take me back where i belong i want it all i had a feeling but the feeling is all gone